How can you lower GGT levels in fatty liver? Hello there. Today, we are going to discuss an important topic, how to lower GGT, gamma glutamyl transferase, levels in fatty liver. Elevated GGT levels are a common marker of liver disease, including fatty liver. But the good news is, there are methods you can adopt to bring those levels down and improve your liver health. Let's delve into them. What is GGT? Firstly, we need to understand what GGT is. GGT is an enzyme found in several organs, but it's most concentrated in the liver. If your liver is damaged, levels of GGT may rise, signaling that something is wrong. Why do we need to lower GGT levels? High GGT levels can signify damage or inflammation in the liver. This can often be a consequence of conditions like fatty liver disease. By lowering GGT levels, we aim to reduce this inflammation and, therefore, minimize liver damage. How can we lower GGT levels? There are several ways to lower GGT levels, most of which involve lifestyle changes. 3.1 Healthy Diet Maintaining a healthy diet is crucial. A diet rich in fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains is recommended. You should also reduce the intake of processed foods, saturated fats, and sugars. 3.2 Regular Exercise Engaging in regular physical activity can help you shed excess weight, which can in turn help manage fatty liver disease and lower GGT levels. Aim for a minimum of 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise or 75 minutes of vigorous intensity exercise per week. 3.3 Limit Alcohol Consumption Alcohol can damage or destroy liver cells, leading to inflammation and a rise in GGT levels. Reducing or eliminating alcohol consumption is crucial. 3.4 Maintain a healthy weight If you are overweight, losing weight can help improve liver health and reduce GGT levels. Aim for a weight loss of 5 to 10% of your body weight initially. Remember, the goal is gradual, sustainable weight loss. Can medication help? In some cases, medication might be needed, especially if lifestyle changes aren't enough. Always consult your healthcare provider for personalized advice. They might prescribe medications that help reduce liver inflammation or treat underlying conditions contributing to high GGT levels. In summary, lowering GGT levels in fatty liver is achievable through a combination of a healthy diet, regular exercise, limiting alcohol consumption, and maintaining a healthy weight. If needed, medication may also be part of the strategy. Remember to consult with your healthcare provider before making significant changes to your lifestyle or starting new medications. Taking care of your liver health is an important part of overall wellness. We hope this video has been informative and helpful. Until next time, stay healthy.